after this. Let's do the news, as I said. Right, the news. And, of course, we have been off the air for a while. God, and... he's such a child. Yeah, where is he? Anyway? I don't know. In the audience, somewhere flicking me, people's ears, and blaming people next. Oh, here excuse me. Hi. Some of the charm. What? You you wearing that for a bit? Yeah. Uh, anyway, <laughs> Lewis Hamilton. He's done it. World champion! What a man! What a man! Or... Oh, twice on the trot! Yeah. Still, never mind, Lewis. Next year, third time lucky. Well, why do we record this on a Wednesday? I've no idea. Because if we did it on a Sunday, we'd know that by now. I oh, know, it's just the end of the world. I tell you what, if we recorded on a Sunday, we'd know who'd won Strictly Come Dancing, and then we could tell everybody. <laughs> uh, now, OK, there's been a financial crisis. Is it the first time you've heard of it? <laughs> What happened, in essence, as far as I can work out, is that, I think because we were off the air, everyone got bored, so banks started lending money they hadn't got to other banks that gave the non-existent money to Mexicans in Southern California who couldn't pay it back. And now, as a result of that, your cars are all worthless. Yeah. I think what I've done there is summarise the financial crisis you quite well. it off nicely. <laughs> I was having dinner the other night with a man, and we were talking about the financial problems, and he said he bought a Volkswagen Phaeton, OK, the five-litre V10, OK? Mm -hmm. Paid £60,000 for it 18 months ago, just been offered 17. How? That's £85 a day depreciation on a Volkswagen. You're going to feel that. You wake up in the morning, I'm 85 pounds worse off than I haven't even started yet. <laughs> I can beat that. Oh, really? Yes. The Aston Martin V8 Vantage, a nice one, 88,000 pounds list price. We know somebody who's got one of these, actually. Course, yeah, we do. It? It's, um, hang on, it's, it's, it's not, uh, it, uh, it's not Oh, you. no, it's the Clarkson. That's it. I knew, yeah, yeah, I knew yeah. somebody. I'm yeah. not going to enjoy this, am no, I? No, do carry no. on, please. No, a car just like yours. The one you've got. It was £88,000 new with a few extras on it. Guess how much that was worth a year later. <laughs> Go on, what? James. £44,000. Half oh, its value, gone. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Halved its value. The only one here got a V8 Vantage? Oh, well, well, you're all better off as a result. <laughs> <laughs> Has anybody here got a Vanquish? Here? Yeah. No, because they're here, James. That's very true. <laughs> um, that's even worse. That's uh, £175,000. Mm -hmm. Guess how much that car was worth after 10,000 miles? Guess how much you got for it? No idea. £50,000. That's one hundred and twenty-five grand in, in... 10,000 miles? Yep. So that means if his nearest shop is two miles away and he pops out for a pint of milk, that's... 50 quid? Yep. Just because of the... 50 <laughs> pounds no, for a pint? That's 50 pounds in depreciation. That doesn't include, you know, tyre wear, petrol, insurance, milk. <laughs> that's a lot of... You see, I get my milk from the back of a cow. It's much cheaper. The back of a... That's not milk. I'm not going to let my wife... <laughs> ..under a cow. <laughs> It's not just Aston's, OK? Mercedes-Benz CL600, the big coupe. Yeah. 2004. Yeah. How much do you think it's worth now? Well, that's... Well, it depends on a million things. Like, is it baby diarrhoea brown? No, it's black. Has it a done black... a million miles? No, it's done 30,000 miles. What so a four-year-old... They were 100 grand, those things, about four years ago, about 100 grand? Yeah. So 100,000 pounds, four years old, 30,000 miles in black, mm -hmm. with extras, yep. 50. 55. 16. 60. 16. 16,000? He got £16,000 for it. I'd have given him 16 and a half. I'd have gone to 17. <laughs> Are you right, watching? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you, you sold it Ooh, cheap. I'll yes. tell you exactly what's happened here, all right? Since 1993, the whole world's been... Well, with flashcards, anyway, has been playing musical chairs, OK? And the music's just stopped, so whatever car you've got now, or house, that's it for life. <laughs> James. Bad news. The Dacia Sandero. The what? The Dacia Sandero is not coming to the UK. Oh. Now, uh, British car... <laughs>